Pakistan and Saudi Arabia have signed a strategic mutual defense agreement, under which any aggression against either country will be treated as an act of aggression against both countries. Defense Minister Rajnath Singh has said, that Operation Seen Dur is only on pause, and will be resumed with full force if any future terror attack is launched from across the border. An Indian Air Force IL-76 transport aircraft touched down in Myanmar with 120 Indian soldiers on board, to take part in joint military exercises alongside the Myanmar Army. Israel's Ministry of Defense has announced that its Cyan Beam High Power Laser Based Air Defense System has successfully completed operational testing. An export capable version is being developed, that will be pitched to foreign customers. DCX Systems Limited has signed a non binding memorandum of understanding with the Tamil Nadu government to establish a state of the art manufacturing facility for high end electronic warfare systems and radar systems. Koresha Technologies has signed a 66 crore rupees contract with the Indian Navy to supply indigenously developed underwater remotely operated vehicles that will clean ship hulls, assist in minor salvage work, and inspect submerged infrastructure. The DRDO is developing a 15 kg lightweight air-to-surface missile with dual seekers for hail and mail UAVs, that will have submeter accuracy and 20 km range, which will be tailored to hit enemy bunkers radars vehicles and logistics nodes. The DRDO developed advanced quad cyanate is to composite radome for platforms like Tejas Mark 1A and AMCA is now ready for mass production. The DRDO has opened technology transfer to Indian industry, with Hindustan Aeronautics Pirate Electronics Limited and Tata Advanced Systems among the leading contenders. The DRDO and Indian Air Force are collaborating on developing the FUFA futuristic unmanned fighter aircraft, which is a stealth twin-engine UCAF with artificial intelligence and internal weapons base, that will carry the 160 km range Astra Mark II missiles for air-to-air -air combat and Brahmo's NG for strike roles, and the FUFA could integrate into Indian Air Force's wider teaming ecosystem under the CATS program. The 97 additional Tejas Mark 1A deal will include 68 single-seat fighters and 29 twin-seat trainers, all built to the Mark 1A standard to ensure uniformity in training and operations. Latest media reports indicate that India will sign the $22 billion deal with France for 114 Rafale F4.1 fighters as early as next fiscal year. The plan includes 18 jets in flyaway condition and 96 to be assembled in India, with Dassault Aviation setting up a final assembly line targeting 60% indigenization. The new F4.1 standard will feature enhanced infrared search and track system, upgraded RBE-2 Acer radar, improved spectra electronic warfare suite, advanced data links for secure and high-speed communication, micro new generation missile, new generation helmet mounted display, upgraded cockpit displays and ergonomics, predictive maintenance system, artificial intelligence assisted sensor fusion, compatibility with loyal wingman new AVs. Upgraded scalp cruise missile with better resistance to countermeasures, and hypersonic nuclear missile compatibility. It will also feature meteor missile full integration with expanded networking for mid course updates from other raffles in the network, or CATS Warrior and OAX aircraft, which means the launch platform can turn away immediately after meteor firing, while others feed the missile fresh target data, dramatically increasing its no escape zone. Hindustan Aeronautics has argued that its decades of experience infrastructure and skilled workforce make it the safest choice to lead the AMCA program, while private defense firms counter that competing with HAL is like facing a monopoly, and they stressed on private sector's leaner and more efficient production methods and readiness for AMCA manufacturing. Experts have suggested a hybrid path, that HAL and Aeronautical Development Agency should retain control over stealth systems and final assembly, while private players handle sub-assemblies and advanced manufacturing to improve efficiency and reduce bottlenecks. Today's Top 3 Comments
Tangent.